Dark Souls 3 is a fantastic game, and looking back, I only have fond memories of my first time playing through it. For instance, I really like the part where you walk inside these huge catacombs, and the place looks really big, lots of paths to take, but if you pay attention, you can realize that you can actually skip most of it if you just roll and fall down the right place. Isn't that what we love about these games? Like, they reward players that pay attention? Yeah, um, this, this was pretty great. Another great moment was when you enter into this great snowy city, and you can see a cathedral in the background. You walk across a narrow pathway that seems to be isolated at first, but then you realize that there's an invisible enemy that charges right at you, and you have to be extremely careful because this beast can actually snatch with its fangs and chew you like you were gone. It's... oh, um... Well, one second, this, this is the wrong footage. Um, let, me, let me fix it. There. So, yeah. It's a tough battle. And the worst part is that when you actually think you've defeated and you won't see this enemy ever again, it actually shows up again later in the same area where you come across not one, but two of these. It's ridiculous. One of the toughest fights in the entire game if they both gang up on you. Ah, oh, man. This, this was really challenging. Oh, and, and how about the time? Where you're walking through this very eerie place and you come across a winged monstrosity that looks really menacing and he seems to be protecting some sort of child that you can hear screaming in the background but oh hang on one one second there that's that's the right footage uh yeah but then you realize that the child isn't actually there and yeah dude that that was really one of my favorite parts all in all, Dark Souls 3 is filled with unique moments like this that you just have to experience for yourself. Now, to be fair, some people have pointed out that there's a concerning lack of common fruits in this game, but that is just nitpicking. Now, I, I know what you're thinking, right? Last time I talked shit about Dark Souls 3, things didn't go so well for me. But th this time I'm being honest. From the bottom of my heart, this is a great game, and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. It's for this reason and this reason alone that I'm giving it a perfect odd score of 9 out of 9. Yeah, that's that's everything. That, that was my review. You, you can leave now. Oh, and, and don't forget to close the door on the way out. There you go. And... There. Okay, so now that the kids are gone... I can finally speak my mind. Is Dark Souls 3 a good game? No, it's not. Dark Souls 3 fucking sucks. And it's all the fault of this man, Hidetaka Miyazaki, the director of Dark Souls 3. Playing through the game, one can only imagine the decisions this man has taken during the production. Mr. Miyazaki, what are we gonna do about the cat ring? Make it remove all fall damage. All fall damage? Did I fucking stutter? Alright, and, and how about the Corinth ring? In Dark Souls 2, it used to have 25% regen bonus. What should it be this time? 7%! Only 7%? It's okay. Players can go into New Game Plus and get a better version of the ring. Okay, so we will have a Corinth ring plus one. And how much is this one gonna regenerate? Hmm. 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 8%! After seeing Priscilla's very detailed feed, some people speculated that Miyazaki maybe had a thing for this particular part of the human body, but they were wrong. Miyazaki is not into feet. He's actually into fucking hands. Amputated hands, big dragon hands, souls of fucking hands, what the fuck is up with that? Oh, and let's not forget about these fucking abominations, what the fuck are those? That is some real kinky shit going on there, and I don't like it one bit. In summary, Dark Souls 3 is not worth your money, so don't buy it. And if you've already made the mistake of buying it, don't play it. Because it's not worth your time either. Anyway, that, that was everything. Thank you for watching. Looking pretty good. Alright, Dragon Slayer Ornstein, ready. Uh, who's next? Oh, nice. Artur is the Abyss Walker. Uh, don't forget to change sword, he was left handed. Uh, where's La. Oh my god. Lachinus! I said GO!
Gonk, you fucking idiot. Not Smog. Smog's not even a Knight of Wind. Oh, you're feeling... Nope. Don't step any closer. You're not playing with us. That's right. We don't need you. Get the fuck out of my world. It's okay, guys. We can do it ourselves. What? You're feeling sorry for him? You're fucking feeling sorry for him? I'm wearing this gay-ass ring so my character looks like a woman and he can't even get the right character. Fuck Laganus. Here's the reason I hate this game.